Oh, hey, didn't see you there. Oh, what this? You know, it's the best app in the world using Marvel's developers API and shiz. But guess what? I'm willing to teach it to you. All you have to do is, you know, suck my dick. Alright, just letting you know, I think creating apps programmatically is so much better than storyboard and stuff. So yeah, changed my mind. So without further ado, let's open up Xcode. First thing we have to do is create a new Xcode project. And then after that, click on the single view application, click next, and name it whatever you like. I'm going to name mine comic book, Marvel comic book. After that, you want to go over to the language section and put it as Swift, not Objective-C, Swift. And then all this other stuff, the checklist, you don't have to do. That is something maybe in the future tutorial that I would love to explain. But for now, press next. And then create in whatever directory you would like to put it in. And voila. Next, we're going to be at the Marvel comic book main page when it, when you open the Xcode project. But we're going to go and direct to the viewcontroller.swift file. As you can see, I've already deleted the extra function below. All you need is the view did load. So just go ahead and delete that. Now let's have a tea break. What the f it's always important to know the outline of our project. Looking at the finishing product, I'm using a UI collection view controller embedded in a navigational stack. Groovy. At the top of the controller, there's a large text title instead of a default one because I lack the imaginary skills to make it more presentable. Anyways, when I click on one of these cells, let's say Adam Warlock, he's f***ing Jack by the way, and hot. Wait, what? You'll see the detailed view controller. And inside the controller, you see two different UI attributes. One is UI image view, which is, you know, Adam Warlock. And the other is the Adam Warlock name and description. Those two are the same UI labels. Since we're doing this programmatically, let's first change the name of viewcontroller.swift to something more relatable to our Marvel project. Hmm. Let's see. Oh yeah, Marvel controller. Genius. Now, let's go to the appdelegate.swift file. What is appdelegate, you may say? You can think of them as a template of basic code needed to run your project out of the box. Of course, if you run, you will only see a white screen. Ignore uiscreen.main.bounds for now. Under it, I already created an instance of the class Marvel Controller. Let Marvel Controller equal Marvel Controller with the parentheses closing. But before we go further, let's make the Marvel Controller into a UI Collection View controller instead and add a UI Collection View delegate flow layout. Now, go back to app delegate. Change the Marvel controller class parameter to take in a UI collection view layout. Then on top, create an instance of UI collection view layout called layout and fill it inside the empty parameter at the bottom. Next, let's set the Marvel controller as the root view controller of window. Finally, make the window, which is assigned to Marvel controller as dot make key and visible. This will enable the Marvel controller to be shown on the application when it's run. Delete the rest of the boilerplate code as we don't need it anymore. It's unnecessary AF. All right, from app delegate, we would like to go back to Marvel controller. Inside here, we would like to set the background color of the collection view. So collection view dot background, which is the property of collection view to dot red to dot blue dot whatever. Usually it would be UI color dot red or blue or so, but in short, you can do dot red or any other color. And also a good practice that many developers do is you set up like, let's say set up UI and then we create a private function and put this line of code in here and delete this code. And all you have to do is build and run. But before we do that, uh, I don't think I've shown you this. I changed the viewcontroller.swift to marvelcontroller.swift. So make sure to change that on the left corner right here. And then we run the project. It's lit. Obviously, we haven't gone through that much today, as part one was only an introduction, like a teacher handing out a syllabus before you get f***ed. Sorry for my French. Anyways. I hope you learned something because part two is going to be really lit, like lit lit. So stay tuned, like, comment, subscribe, 